My name is Alex Cecilio. I'm a graphic artist, and I'm going to show you how to draw a cute monster with the pen tool in Photoshop. Now, I, th I definitely think that the pen tool is the best um, tool to use for this particular draw kind of drawing, so I'm just going to go ahead and start off by just making... The reason the pen tool is so great for something like this is because of its um, ability to be really flexible and a lot like a like an actual pen. Um, and what I just did was I used the free form pen tool instead of the actual like pen tool. And the way you get that is just by going over to the pen tool, holding down on it, and selecting free form pen tool. So then once I've made my basic first shape, I'm going to right click and I'm going to say um, fill path. And I'm going to use the foreground color. And then with, this pen, with the pen tool still selected, right click and then say delete path. So that way it'll get rid of your path. And then I'm actually going to make a copy. And the way I do that is by holding down Option or Alt and dragging it. And I'm just going to change the color. And I will tell you why in just a moment. Oops. Okay. So then I'm going to actually just go ahead and just erase everything except for the antlers. So that way I can just put them right on top of the purple ones, like so. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and draw some I'm going to fill my path. I'm actually going to change the feet color. And then you can go ahead and copy it if you want to. And then just put that underneath so that it looks more like it's actually underneath. And I'm not going to give him arms because I think that's cute. Um, all right, so. What's really going to make your monster cute is his face. <clears throat> so I'm just going to go ahead and add another layer. And I'm going to play around with some shapes. Actually, what actually happened was I didn't delete my path. And I'm going to actually go back and show you how to do that, because that's really important. So my leg. What you'll know when it's deleted because it, it won't that line won't be there. So just right click and say delete path, and that way it won't fill because otherwise it'll fill any other path that you've got. All right, I'm gonna fill it, right. and now I'm gonna actually delete that layer delete the path again, and then I'm just going to move it and copy it, and then I'm going to rotate it by going to free transform, and then flip horizontal. And if you want, you can even warp it. If you go to free transform, and then you right click again, you say warp, you can make it so that it's more perspective, the perspective is more accurate. Okay, so we're almost done here. Now I'm gonna use the, actually, now I'm gonna keep using the, the pen tool. So I'm gonna make the eyes. Okay, and then I'm gonna delete my path again. And then now I'm just going to use the paintbrush tool because I actually think I'm all set with the, pe uh, the freeform pen tool for like the eyes right now. 
And you can do whatever you want as far as shine. Um, but definitely make it shiny if you want it to be cute. And then I'm just going to go ahead and add a mouth. And this is the cool thing about the freeform pen tool. My favorite personal thing is... So now that I've, with the freeform pen tool, I've made this, um, this shape. So then I'm going to go ahead, instead of filling it, I'm going to, instead of fill path, I'm going to say stroke path. And this is going to actually, you can or, you don't have to, but I'm going to see what happens when I, okay. So then now it'll, it'll create a line where I've just drawn. So I'll delete my path. You've got your cute monster. My name is Alex, and this is how you make a cute monster with a pen tool in Photoshop. Thank you.